Hello and welcome. This video goes out to a Cameron Maxwell who's asking for some assistance on wiring up a um, first company style fur down air handler. This particular heat strip, I guess you would call it this whole assembly, was taken out of an old air handler and uh, I keep them for parts. So I kind of disconnected all the wires. Cameron, I'm really hoping that this helps. I'm gonna try my best to explain it. Everything from the 240 volt coming in all the way down to the thermostat. So here we go. So what we have is <coughs> to wire up the fan relay. You can tell this fan relay, it has six little prongs on top. This is gonna be your 24 volt coming in. And this is gonna be your fan speeds, high speed, low speed. We'll get into it now. So this wire right here is gonna be your line coming in. You can see it's right here. I'm just gonna show you, I'll pull it completely out. So this is what's gonna be wired up to the actual uh, disconnect system. So this wire will actually go onto the outer bank of this fan relay. That's going to be, you got a piggyback right there. You can kind of see that another terminal is going to join onto this. So we're going to keep it one leg at a time just to kind of show you what we're working with right here. All right. You also, we're going to need to power, we've got to send voltage 20, 240 volts. One leg of it needs to go to your sequencer. So you have this little beauty right here that jumps across. So we're going to go ahead and plug it back onto here. Then you're gonna need to power your transformer. Transformer is a 240 volt in, 24 volt out. So we're gonna go ahead and plug that baby right over here. If I can get this wire to come around. I'm gonna plug it on. All right. Now you got this random wire up here. It's coming off your sequencer. So again, voltage comes in, purple wire goes to this bank, piggybacks off. Basically it's a junction is all this is. Ain't nothing special, just a junction. Comes off, runs over here to your sequencer. Whenever you apply 24 volts to your heater, the sequencer engages, it closes, sends voltage into your heat strip, and it also sends voltage coming back on this wire to this bank. That is going to be your low speed on your fan. That is your high speed on your fan. And if you remember on my last video, if you look here, whenever the coil is engaged, two and four close, five and six open. So this is a normally, this bank going across here to here, is normally closed. So whenever the unit is sitting with no voltage going to your 24 volts, you have these two terminals are always closed. When you energize this coil, these two open, and then these two close uh, here and here. All right. So now we are gonna get to the <coughs> fan. So I just have some wire sitting here just for illustration. So your red wire is going to be your low speed. So we're going to try and connect that onto here. Your black wire is your high speed. That's going to go on the outer bank. And then your common wire, this little yellow wire, sometimes is uh, white. This one, this particular one is yellow. That is going to go onto this little piggyback or the commons of all of them. So you can see on this bank right here, you have yellow, which is for your fan. You have white with this white one actually is the other line of the 24, 240 volts going into your transformer. And then you got this little beauty, which is your other leg of your 240 volts. So you got one leg here that sends voltage to this little guy. And then your other leg goes here. 
Now on the 24 volt side, <coughs> you're gonna have your green wire. This is gonna be going, coming back from your thermostat. So you got your power, remember your power going to your thermostat. You got your common, you got your heat, and you got your fan relay. Fan relay can be controlled by just basically by turning the thermostat in the on position. But your green wire can go to your fan relay. And then your common, you can see it coming off, directly off of the transformer. It's yellow, goes to blue. And because it's, we're calling it common because it shares. You can see this blue wire also goes to your heat sequencer and then the common goes out. So we'll go ahead and connect it on. And then these two, you'll wire nut these to your pigtail coming in from your disconnect. Um, Cameron, I hope this helps. If not, let me know in the comments below and I'll do what I can to help you as best that I can. Um, thank you for watching.